out here cruising the strip on Friday evening on our bikes, checking out some trucks. This is one of my favorites here this evening. Nice clean build here, small block Chevy V8 in it. Like that twin snorkel air cleaner on it. This looks like a 55 Chevy right here. $58,000 and it can be yours. Big window cab. I really like this color and just plain steel wheels and hubcaps. Nicely lowered. You just don't get much better than that. Here's another fine Chevy truck right here. This is kind of a satin burgundy color. Very unusual color combination. I'm not sure what color those wheels are exactly, but I like the, uh, again, the stilly wheels and the hubcaps, just a nice clean look. <clears throat> Very clean under the hood, small block V8 in it, air conditioning, all polished accessories, nice, nice truck. This one's priced at 45000 I've always enjoyed these uh, little uh, pace car Camaros. interesting little tidbit about these cars I really like is this houndstooth interior and I like the uh, color combo on these this white and orange here's another favorite of mine this Friday night this diamond T this is a 1936 diamond T I imagine this was probably a retired fire truck. These right here are turn signals that come out. Love this detail on the tail lights. custom pinstriping all over this thing. <laughs> this entire build is just outstanding. Diamond T is powered by a 454 cubic inch big block Chevy engine. And it looks like it's got all the accessories on it. It can be yours for $125,000. Outstanding little 1941 wheelies right here. Very detailed, kind of electric blue color. A little bit of metallic in it. Most of these you see are gassers. This is a uh, streetcar. Y'all, I am in love with this four-door 1961 Impala. Slammed on the ground. Little white walls on it. Plain steel wheels with hubcaps. Survivor paint on it. 
but I love the roof rack. You could haul all kinds of junk on that in style. Is this your car, young man? It's not mine, it's actually my dad's. What's your name? Hey, Brady, yours? Hot Rod Dad. Yes, Tell me about this thing. Well, it's a 61 Impala. Uh, basically all original. The rack on top of it, it's actually my, my papa built it. And they can do about anything you want him to do. And then it's not, it's got air rod, but the bags on it, it's not. It's a basic system kind of. We got it from a name brand called Street Machinery. It lives up in Ohio. Oh yeah, yeah I'm familiar with, with them. Yeah. That's cool. Looks like you right. got a couple of vintage bikes back here to yeah. cruise around on the strip. Just, we actually just put that tire on. So is this one yours? Take off. Yeah, this is mine. That's dad's. It's had that forever. Looks like you're doing a little mechanic in work on this one. Just tighten up the front tire. That's how I had to fit them in here. That's how we got them up here. So you put them in the trunk and, and hauled them up right here. Off. Yes, sir. Awesome, man. Hey, thanks for telling us about yeah, your you car. Know. Yeah, thank you. Here is a beautiful little black 32 Ford Roadster. It's got cowl steering on it. Buy supply big and littles. Flathead power, often house her heads, and it's got a blower on it. Here's an interesting 56 Chevy drag car. Notice something different about it? This is shortened down from a four door, it looks like. And this sucker is race ready with a blown big block with dual quads. period correct glitter steering wheel this thing looks like it is ready to tear up the drag strip another Friday night favorite right here is this little Dodge Brothers pickup Hemi powered Cadillac air cleaner. Suicide doors, and those are factory. Always like that little detail about these pickups. Tilt out windshield for some airflow. Looks like it's got a 39 Ford Banjo steering wheel on it. Model A pickup bed. Big and little bias ply wide white walls. Cool little pickup. Get One of the best things about this show is everybody's out cruising the strip and they just line the sidewalks up with chairs and watch the cool cars go by. Here's another gasser inspired build right here. Dubbed the Rabid Rodent. Check out that red plexiglass. about 
the right time of the evening to just chill out, let the cool rides come to us. And that's just what we're doing right here. There's just a little bit of everything up here this year, including a rolling pontoon boat. One of the really cool things about this venue is in Pigeon Forge, there's lots of stuff for kids to do. There's arcades, there's go-karts over here. I think this thing right here is called the puke I don't know. There's another one down the road, and I think it's the tilt a hurl But uh, there's all kinds of things to do for kids. There's an arcade right over here. There's ice cream and uh, barbecue and all kinds of good things to eat all over the place here and nice cool evening hot rods all over the place and it's just a really cool family venue hey y'all thanks for coming along checking out some of the cool rides cruising the strip Friday night after the 2021 shades of the past car show in beautiful downtown Pigeon Forge Tennessee till next time Y'all get out there and build something.